Officials from the New Hampshire Attorney General's Office say Thornton Police Officer Matthew Yao was justified in using deadly force when he shot and killed 37-year-old Ethan Freeman last October. All the other ga evidence gathered from the investigation supports the conclusion that Officer Yao did reasonably believe that he faced the imminent use of deadly physical force from Mr. Freeman at the time when the officer fired his pistol. At a briefing on Tuesday, officials analyzed body cam video from Officer Yao that captured three separate interactions between him and Freeman that day, including the fatal encounter at Freeman's apartment. Officials say that the body cam was critical in this case since they were able to match what the officer said to investigators with what was actually seen on the video. At the apartment, officials say Officer Yao encountered a naked, bloody, and irrational Freeman who, while inside, was holding a broken piece of furniture. In the video, Freeman threatens to kill Officer Yao, jumps out a window, and, while unarmed, advances on him. Officer Yao believed that when Mr. Freeman, who he heard had threatened his life, ultimately reached him, he would attempt to take his gun and shoot him. Officer Yao said he didn't have time to holster his weapon and switch to a non-lethal form of defense. Prosecutors say Officer Yao had seconds to react and what he did was within the law. In Concord, Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.